a do. People need to think long and hard about what they do and how they conduct themselves. A great entertainer, a great philanthropist, uh, Jerry Lee Lewis, comedian and icon. I, he's 91 years old. Some, some people thought he died. Because, you know, you don't see Jerry's kids. You don't see him himself, you know, doing the, 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 the telethons. And, man, I, I love watching the guy. I think he was funny. He was passionate. He was a very giving guy. Muscular dystrophy uh, was a huge concern of his, and I understand that he raised over a billion dollars from what I'm under, from from what I'm hearing. Uh, he was uh, touring Australia to raise money for the country's Muscular Dystrophy Foundation, which is separate from the American Muscular Dystrophy Association, where he served as president. He announced in 2011 that he was retiring as host of the association's Labor Day Telethon, which began hosting in 1966, folks. And then the MDA said uh, they would not be the organization it is today if it were not for Jerry's tireless effort on behalf of the, his kids, his enthusiasm for finding uh, to define cures for neuromuscular disease was matched by his on yielding commitment to see the fight through to the end, Jerry's efforts on the annual MDA telethon transformed the broadcast into an American tradition. Each Labor Day weekend for 45 years, the organization said in a statement, though we will miss him beyond measure, we suspect that somewhere in heaven, he's already urging the angels to give just $1 more for my kids. According to uh, news reports, Jerry uh, suffered from a back condition linked to uh, uh, his comedic uh, pratfall from a piano as, as well as heart problems. He was reportedly had at least two heart attacks. And this comedian, Jerry Lee Lewis, who we're, we're talking about, who you've known for a long time, gained his fame as part of a duo with singer Dean Martin. Uh, and he was born Joseph. Levitch on March 16th, 1926 in Newark, New Jersey. His parents were entertainers. Young Jerry made his debut at age five. Can you believe that? On New York's uh, Caskill Mountains entertainment circuit. Dean Martin. I guess some of you actually might remember that. And if you do, here's a little rolling for you. Bells will ring. Ding -a -ling -a -ling. Uh, Jerry Lee Lewis, Dean Martin, neat stuff. And um, some of you might be a little young and that doesn't, but the name, man, is just uh, Dean Martin. Come on. Uh, good stuff. God bless. Um, Jerry Lewis for uh, his work and uh, the smiles that he gave and touching so many lives across the country. He will definitely be missed. There's no doubt about it, but definitely a huge legacy um, for muscular dystrophy. And by the way, uh, the organization still um, accepts money and they, they still call it, um, from what I understand, uh, the Jerry Lewis uh, Foundation. Um, where they still will, and I'm sure, honor him even this year because they still do raise money. But he was definitely, since 1966, wow, to, uh, to lend his, uh, his, his star power. And people would tune in to, to watch the whole telethon for just days at a time, and they would do this marathon with the guy practically not getting any sleep. I mean, that's how passionate he was to to raise this money and uh, people did and that's a horrible thing to contract muscular dystrophy but uh, hopefully it would be nice to uh, come up with a cure but there's been a lot of a uh, lot of research that's been done and uh, a lot of more treatments that have been made available for people that suffer from from uh, MS and um, we pray that uh, hopefully we'll be able to see some type of total cure uh, from that. And uh, it's not the only disease out there, but uh, it's one that he was very passionate about. And so I'm sure anybody that's had it or has family members 
that uh, have suffered from uh, this dreadful disease. Um, definitely is uh, saying a prayer for uh, Jerry and his family. Um, he died out there in Vegas, I understand, in his home. But 91 years old, and they say that uh, Jerry passed away peacefully at his home of natural causes with his loving family by his side, according to his manager, Mark Rosano. So God bless you, Jerry. And who knows, they might have radio and television up there in heaven. I can't imagine a, a medium like this not being available uh, up there. We got to do something when we get to heaven, right? So <laughs> it probably put Jerry right to work doing something. Folks, we appreciate you uh, helping us out, get the word out about our broadcast. We are 100% listener supported. We appreciate our supporters. If you uh, feel like this resonates with you and you enjoy and find yourself tuning in on a daily basis or somewhat daily basis, um, once you become a monthly supporter at forthepeopleshow.com, you can, well, like Jerry would say, just give a dollar. Uh, if you'd like to give more, that would be fine, but uh, you could subscribe and become a monthly supporter of For the People, and that keeps For the People on the air. We appreciate the supporters that we already have, but we definitely could use more support uh, to help us grow across the country. We have a few initiatives we want to kick off with media, and uh, when you take big ads out, they cost a little money, so uh, we appreciate that. Folks, appreciate you for everything that you do. Thanks for tuning in. Our website's forthepeopleshow.com. You can uh, follow us on Facebook and Twitter there. I'm Keith Allen, For the People, saying all the best. May God bless. Some things in life need a little attention. Like a plant, if not watered, it begins to turn brown. But if watered properly, its leaves turn green again. Like a plant, For the People needs watering too. Your thoughtfulness provides sustainability for us to grow and reach our full potential. You see, For the People depends on you to broadcast this program to help inform and educate folks so you can make a difference right where you are. Grab your watering can and join us as we endeavor to make a difference in people's lives each and every day. To donate, go to ForThePeopleShow.com. That's ForThePeopleShow.com. Just look for the watering can and water as much as you can. At For The People, our garden is full of opportunities, and planting something allows others to enjoy the benefits. At For The People, our mission is simple. Give you the news that matters with good old-fashioned common sense, mixed with a conservative point of view. Simply log on to our website at ForThePeopleShow.com. That's ForThePeopleShow.com. Thanks for your support.